guys. Let me put my mic on so y'all can hear me better. Okay, so um, sorry for the bright light is the window, but um, I'm gonna show you how to do a tutorial on how to make a balloon dog, and uh, I got this idea from Creations Unearthed. I'll show you. I hope you can see it. Okay, there it is. Oops, did that wrong. <laughs> okay, there it is. Um, the balloon dog is made from pipe cleaners on that one, and um, that's why I'm gonna show you how to make one. It should be easy. It's like a pretty much like a five-minute process. So here you will need some scissors and some pipe cleaners, and you need some craft hands. Here's a one-six scale one I made, and uh, you want it to look exactly like this. And um, I didn't make. Okay, look at the back. It doesn't you don't see the blue? Overlap in the paint. I'll show you how to do that. Okay, let's get started. So, what you'll need is probably about this much some pipe cleaner, pink. So, you cut that. Sorry about the noise on my little cousins here. So. Okay, I'm making a six scale one, but it shouldn't be that bad. Okay. Okay. So this is how you make it. You want? Okay. I got it. It's first. Okay. You need two long ones. Okay. Not. Two. You need two blues. About the same size. Probably it doesn't matter if the one's bigger than the other. Okay. I take this one that I already shaped it to the balloon dog type of shape. You overlap this one two times. And uh, it's kind of getting too short. Okay. And you see that the. You see the blue. That, it ain't accurate because the blue, it doesn't show blue like that. So what you do is so you do the pink you overlap the pink like this. You do the pink like this and then you put it back like that. And then you got a pretty good and yeah, this is screwing me up now. I need a bigger part. Okay, there we go. Okay. I got it. Okay, as you can see, the back's now pink, not blue. And um, the limb, one of the limbs is bigger than the other, so I'll have to cut a piece of that off. Okay, that's better. It's too big, at, it's too small, but you'll cut it down the size of its. This could be for a six inch size one. I made a six inch one too, okay. Do the back the same way. You have to have a little bit of access pink. Uh. Okay, so this is what it should look like when you're done with one B. This part right here. Now you can't let this stick out. You have to just do the same thing like the other ones. Overlap it. This one's actually coming out better than the other ones. You want to know why? Because the okay, that's what it looks like so far. Now you can't have a balloon dog without some ears. So it was only one. You know how balloons are. Okay. You just need a couple inches, like two inches, I guess. <coughs> and then you 
overlap. I don't know how I don't know why I'm saying overlap, but you do that. And then basically Basically we're finished. So we are finished with our balloon dog. This is what it looks like next to the one that I very I first made. It came out kind of better than it. I don't know. It's just the legs are real crooked. But um I keep the legs sometimes like this and it stands better. You can position it all you want so it can look like it's walking. Okay, so here's the first one. There's the first one compared to the second one. Yeah. Pull all the pink stuff off, and they look perfect. No, I'll just kind of bend his legs a little bit to go accurate. But this one's more battered in. Okay, so this one's more bigger. So, because the legs are really long, I'll probably have to shorten the legs a little bit. But this is for a 12 inch figure, so that's about it. It's like a five minute process, it's really easy. And we still got some pipe cleaner left. If you want to do another one after that, go ahead. And um, here's a little progress of my little Michael. Mikey. My mask that I'm making. The, uh,. Blade hasn't tried yet. I actually kind of uh, sculpted it a little bit right here and made it rounder so it won't be rough. It's not smooth. Then I'll have to sand it a little bit when um, that's done. So, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. That's about it. And I'll show you a link in the description of Creations Unearthed. They do some good stuff.